to my week of COVID. Forgive me if all this is a little fuzzy. <coughs> Who last left off the gamers? Well, after cleaning up the mess at their keep, figuring out what they need to do next. I hate names, forgive me. But the big lady, which I nicknamed her. Kill Y. Kill Y has told us to meet her at the forest. So we was going to travel there, but before we head off, I noticed that my god-ish powers is fading. So I asked the team if we can go and fix that by going to the nearest light temple. Upon the rival, we found out it wasn't empty. It was being remodeled in a sort of way with people trashing it. Killing people and throwing them out the door. <clears throat> <laughs> Would do such a thing. Which, forgive me, what um, what is your character's name again? Hildurek. Hildurek von Muskel. Hildurek. Oh. oh gosh, I am going to suck it. Sorry. It's fine. <laughs> Hildurek. Proceed to throw some unwanted guests out with Kilobai right there. <laughs> but the battle wasn't quite over as the uninvited guests decided to... March in the army with a summon demon after dispatching said control device on the demon and almost killing everybody in the process. Somehow, our dear silence dragged that demon into a unknown place that is so <laughs> freaky I don't want to talk about and save the day. <laughs> That's about it because everybody else ran off. Uh, it, it... Pretty much, yeah, yeah. Um, by the way, uh, uh, just to let you know, Silent, yep. I wanted to let you know that um, you now have access, uh, you should now have this, uh, the fifth year of Aspect of the Devil. Woo! <laughs> um, so as we, um, come back to our heroes, um, you guys are standing in front of the ruined bull. What do you guys do? I, okay, our undead friend is still pretty hard, right? Yeah, I'm yeah. feeling really toasty. I was going to try. I don't know if this is going to work, but Toll of the Dead and see if it reheals him. Do I make the wisdom save? The uh, chronic damage for you would technically heal you. So it's a question on whether or not you want to actually accept. Uh... I have no idea what's going on. This is a spell being cast at me. But yeah, I think I'm going to accept it. I don't think I'm getting attacked right now. Okay, so since you do accept it, you instantly fail your wisdom save and you heal 1d12 Otic. So, so let me roll that for you. Oh, nice. Nice. Thank you. As I'm feeling slightly less dead. Oof, ah. Yep, slightly you say less. that and I automatically back off. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I guess that was kind of ironic. Uh, I guess slightly more undead? Still not the greatest thing for me. Um, uh, I guess we kind of got off to a rough start. Um, ignore all the dead bodies. I, I swear, I'm pretty nice. I hope that you guys will let me come with you, maybe? I'm sure half of these undead... I mean, not undead. Oh, gosh. Most of these dead bodies were created by that devil witch silence. What the heck happened? Yeah, um, I. What was that actually? What was that portal and whatever was inside of it? I I only got a glimpse and I'm I'm reeling in my head right now. Surprise! I don't know. Uh, can I? I'm only silence and I get a religion. Uh, you know that um. That aspect of the devil when used on your little summon, especially tier five, tier five used on summon is unpredictable. And what you basically did on accident, you opened up a temporary portal to the nine hells. <laughs> Wonderful. Specifically, from what your religion is telling, from what you what you can gather from your religion check, you actually opened it up to the seventh level. Ooh, cool. Which I'm blinking. <coughs> well, whatever you did, it was freaky. It worked. I'm, 
Okay, I mean, yeah, so... you could say that. It, it got rid of the, the big guy, so I, I do not understand the problem. Okay, give me a sec. And are you okay, Ritz and everybody else? Anybody else need Uh, Its name healing? is Mala Domini. Mm. Uh, let's see here. Ruins of old cities, stagnant rivers, exhausted and abandoned quarries and strip mines, stone aqueducts and lava canals, torturous swarming of biting flies and blacks of pool, black pools of ichor that erupt from the ground. Wonderful. Ah, uh, nightmare. Yeah, yeah, basically. So, from what I can gather, does this not happen often? Summoning demon portals to God knows where? Actually, Ooh. believe it or not, it happens a lot more often. Thought it did. Silence, I will say that you did not see the full beast within action. I would say, like, you didn't see the full beast within the uh, circle. You only saw its hand drag the other to it. Hildrick, however, saw the full beast. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, I, it was bigger than what I was grappling. That's pretty well, it took care of the problem, so it's okay in my eyes. Mm. See, the problem is, if we don't know how to use this power, then that that's kind of concerning. I think I can do it on command. I don't think it will just, like, randomly pop out and grab anyone. I don't think I control it anyway, so it could just do that, but that's not up to me. Anyway. So, Wait, what? You know, what? Like, it's, it's probably pretty powerful if it's that big, you know, like, it's, like, from hell, you know? Like, if it wants to want grab one of you, that's not up to me. That's just up to, like, the world at that point. Oh, real oh, soon. Puts her hands in her face. Sounds like something we might want to work on at some point. I don't control the, the demons down in hell. They are their own beings. You're letting them into our, our plane of existence. Okay, yeah, but if I, okay, if I do it, it's fine. Like, I can I can control it when I do it. But if they want you, that's that's just on you. They can uh, walk here by themselves without my help. Goodbye. We should definitely work on this at some point. I was mute. Uh, <laughs> oh, hello. Sorry. You don't need to yell Alice? that. Yes. With great power comes great responsibility. Oh, no. Not <laughs> I will use it well, I promise. Okay, I understand we're called the gamers, Make but sure we don't need to use books. the gamer tags. I still can't get over that we're called the gamers. Or you, you're called the gamers, sorry. <laughs> Do you have a better name suggestion? No, but... Exactly. There has to be something better than the gamers. There isn't. We agreed on this other group. We did. A whole week of going back and forth. Oh, and this week? was... And yeah. Our brains were like, blah. You don't really... Like, if we didn't want to sound God. too cocky, and we didn't want to sound too dumb. I mean, my question is, kind of... what are games? All right, Synth, now you can do your catch line. What okay. catch She just asked what game was. What game? Really? You're not going to try to sell her a chess plate? Not a chess plate. Oh, chess set. No, checkers. Oh, oh my that gosh. That was the lady? Yes. Oh shit, never mind. China Excuse me. Why chess board? <laughs> never mind, ma'am. I got a business proposition to you. <laughs> oh, well, I board. hate to bring this up, but I... I cut off. Yeah, same here. Mm. Oh, no. Well, I hate to bring this up, but I'm not the one who said that. Wait. Oh, I hate this. You know, I feel like... Perception there's check. Some, there should be some apologies here for Kilowai. I mean, she did kind of roast it up. Um, there was a lot of friendly Eleven. Why do you have advantage? Because of my eyes. Uh, um, the voice is coming from everywhere, but nowhere at the same time. You can't really pinpoint where it is. I hate you, Brits. <laughs> I know all. Brits, it's coming inside of the temple. We'll be in the temple. Well, what was the temple? You guys came with somebody else. I, I did? I don't know, no, that's what I'm asking. I'm still surprised that Kilowai was. I mean, I I didn't know that was Kilowai. Second, um, uh, yeah, there, uh, there's someone in there. Yes. I guess we should investigate because last I checked, there was no one alive in. That is still Who freaking said me. Alive? Oh, okay. Show yourself, please. Thank you. Oh, lime who can talk, oh, but manners. Yes, quite. Sorry, <laughs> my sincerest apology. As see you a bright. Bright light shine through the um, ruins of the temple and come to a halt in front of the double doors and form into a humanoid that looks like an elf with long, longish um, white hair, golden robes. His face seems 
shine a little bit. Well, thank God doesn't look undead. So, but, but who is this? Who are you? Okay, if I had to guess, just because this is crucial, uh, crucial uh, I can't speak. <laughs> oh, hush. Voice in the <laughs> If I have to say anything, this is the God of Light? Why are there so many gods here? What, Different what is world. going on? BS. Meet up. Okay, I didn't do a lot of things. Okay, the, the worst thing I did was break out of here. Okay, what? <laughs> okay, explain what you broke out of was thousand miles south. This is north in a different country. Yes, um, that is very true. I could not give you answers as to why I was brought here, but I am here, and there's gods here. It's a temple. Oh yeah, I knew that. It's technically not a temple. It it would be a temple if it weren't burnt down. Yeah, we could just ask who he is very politely. I I was waiting for him to introduce himself. I guess my bad for my man. So, uh, you a light god? Just an elf dude. Does he have like that planted expression? Like, are you done yet? <laughs> He's, he, he he has his hand clapped behind his um uh behind his uh back. And he has a very calm, very jovial expression on his face. And sting you, boy. Crackers. My name is Allah. A L A H. Oh, Allah. A L. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I thought um, it was cut off. It's it's uh, Allah. A L A F. A L A F. I. God of okay, that was cut off. That was indeed. Zach. Okay. Happy bloody he will be missed. <laughs> He'll be right back. He will be missed. Can you hear me now? Oh my yes. God, zombie. It's your Bob. Uh, okay. Discord in the reception. I am Allah. Le. Pleasure to meet you. Sadly, there was an understand between you and well. Uh, Theocracy. My sincerest apology for that. So, are they going to uh, keep on coming after you or something? Well, sadly, they thought this was a temple to one of the rival gods to their own. So, you see, they attacked their I, own. They were misinformed by Shurashana, god of death. Sadly, he pimps. Oh, how he's me. You have prevented the total annihilation of my temple. How may I be a service? Or how may I guide you to push Rio forward? Or not really. Rosie forward? Uh, hi. Hello. Uh, dear. Has he has a very concerned look on his face. Yeah. My domain don't usually mix with your domain. Oh, that is not it, my dear. You have been tainted. Well, yeah, she is a butt, but that's a different story. But her power is fake. You're here for a contract. I hate those words. Well, if you are here for to be in service of to gain access to my power, there is a few things I wish for you to do for me. They're very simple. They must be done. I'll hear First. you out. And debate on it. First and foremost, you must take your current god out loud to the both of us. <laughs> Why are you stepping away, you... What are you talking about? I was here the entire time. Uh-huh. I saw you back away. Okay, what's the other <laughs> thing? <laughs> the entire time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Secondly, oh, well, you will use these powers not only to help your friend, but... Help others as well. Out of life, bro. I value life overall. All right. There is one additional thing. I feel that you would be willing. I want you to seek out on that. Except for this one. He seems odd. You sure? Because That's I have no problem doing so. <laughs> Wait, which no. one? Huh? He's looking directly at you, Hildrick, and you you feel as if your undead body is getting smaller and smaller and smaller by the second as he's ever again. <laughs> oh man, is it again? I in here. Uh, I'm just gonna just gonna take a few steps over here. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't seem highly dead, which is odd, not that. Anywho, oh, I want you to search. Or undead. Eliminate. As, as much best as you can. As much as I love to do that, 
I probably can't. May I ask one? Uh, she kind of looks at her group. We know someone who primarily handles undead. And... Mine's Ugao. Yeah, I should know. You guys are just in people's heads. No, oh, actually, the soldiers were talking about a powerful undead that they would... Synth, you don't have to run away that far. I'm not running, I'm just sitting chilling. <laughs> <laughs> you can do this, Rozu! Are you <laughs> over there? No reason! My character off way in the distance. <laughs> uh, don't you leave me too. Oh. Uh, meow? What, what is your name? I am not giving my real name. You can forget that. In, if me, that is fine. People call me Rosie. Very well, Rose. Like your friend here, fine. They are not entirely. I wish for you to destroy entirely. Destroy They need to be returned to the afterlife where they belong so that they may continue of rebirth. Them being undead and they being stuck on this name. I get what you're saying, I but like I said, I don't think I can handle that fully. Very well. Do what you can. Not to God after simple flesh and blood. Only handle what you can handle. It's completely under. Now, the third thing. Could you um, remake the contract? Could you get someone to rebuild the temple here? Um, it's a bit drafty and... Um, well, <laughs> I kind of live here. Wait, can a god not just snap his fingers and make it whole again? Unfortunately, us, us higher gods are not allowed to mess with the material plane as this one here. Can't why he just waves her fingers. So she's okay messing with us and you're not okay? She's a demigod, more or less. She aimed goddom through her actions. Okay. I was out of this world before. Ah, uh, before we make this whole contract thing, Majig. You have questions? Yeah, am I going to keep my same powers? I mean, some of my powers are anti-life stuff. Use them for evil? Well, no. And why would they change? Just making the sure. Only, the only is, well, that. He, you see his eyes shine a little bit. And I get a wisdom saving throw. Okay, 24. Okay, you resist it. He was like, oh, well, I was trying to see your true nature, but a very powerful, very powerful cleric, and I'd rather not force my eyes upon you. Yeah, um, that doesn't make me want to do a contract with you. Of course, of course. That is why I wanted what magic you were using. You, you use... Quite a number of magics. I don't know what they are, but I know that you have quite a bit of magic in you. My apologies for pride. That was very deep. My Although magic I depends on know. life and death. It's the balance between the two. It's Although not one or the other. I only look at... Mm. You have the particular... Are there any more? You may ask me anything. I'm trying. I mean... I'm sorry to say, I don't really believe you're a god as much as Kilowai here. It's just... Oh, you want to uh, prove? Eh. But uh, maybe we shouldn't get rash here. Um, oh, I'm sorry if my world before had gods before and I end up this place... Motherfucker. What? <laughs> I'm just gonna... I'm going behind this wall now. No, I think something's at its door. Okay. Oh. Okay, you're going to have to repeat what you just fucking said. <laughs> As I was going on rant say, I really don't believe in gods. <coughs> I'm in you. I mean, our other world had gods, and then we came to this world, so you kind of believe if I say if I don't truly believe in you. All right. Oh, hear me out. How would you like to for me that I am? What, that you're more powerful than the normal person that I have met in this place? Yeah, sure. I'll believe that. I will prove anything within. All right. Go uh, ahead. So, ask you to do something, you can do it, kind of thing, or what? I will attempt. Well, I can't really tell you what am I thinking, because apparently people can read minds here. I choose not to read minds. Yeah, They're that's invasive. What they oh, right. That's what you ask. <laughs> maybe, just just maybe. Uh-huh. Taking him on isn't a good idea. I'm getting serious bad vibes here. Um, Yeah, I, I'm gonna, I'm I'm going to continue hiding. Behind this wall over here. Don't mind me. I could still kind of say you need to duck a little bit more. <laughs> For some odd reason, even though he's blocked by the 
blocked by this wall. They're blocked by this wall and this wall. You can still feel his eyes on you. Yeah, I, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, I, I really don't think this is a good idea. Oh, tell me, Ozu. Yeah. The word. I don't know. I mean, I have seen a lot of crazy stuff. Heck, I know level 100 players can do some crazy stuff. I don't know. Uh, does anybody have an idea what a level 100 player can't do? Uh, are you asking? Oh, I'm asking the group. Um, they can't I, destroy I, the planet. No, no, don't ask them to destroy <laughs> the planet. That'd be kind of bad. Uh, I'm pretty sure we want to still stand. Let's try something a little cool. bit smaller than that. Come on. Well, you were asking what what can't can't a level 100 character do? I was like, eh, destroy the planet. <laughs> not helping. Oh gosh. Exactly. All right, I'm saying he's not a god, so I'm trying to figure out something that a level 100 player can't do that a quote unquote god can do. She basically it wants. To, she basically is trying to test our like a an item based skill. I don't know, like a world. What's the, whatever the highest level here? World class item. Yeah, a world class item skill. What that he can make a world class item just like that. Well, if he is a god, I would assume that he is able to come with. That's kind of true. You know Making what? God tier items. Ask him for a fancy hat. Really? <laughs> a fancy artifact world level hat. Yeah, let's see if he can make a world class item. Yeah, uh, he wants what, specifically a hat. Yeah. hat. Okay. Yeah. Can you make a world class god tier whatever fancy hat, apparently? See him raise very gently and traces invisible symbols there and light bright light shine throughout the wood and you just see him reach through a portal of light and and the light condenses into a hat shape and it goes shine sparkles down you see what looks to be a i would have to say a oh crap what is that hat uh, a fedora <laughs> What kind of hat are you describing? Well, the problem Snapback. is, I have an image uh, 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 image in my head, but I forget the name. I love how we would automatically <coughs> make a world-building item of a hat. A good item to have. Everyone needs a hat. <laughs> it's just a hat. Hats are good. What is another, <laughs> like, what, do you want, like, a wand or something? A staff? A sword? No, it's no. just... It's like you imagine it'd be like a staff or a sword or a set of armor. No, it's a hat. No, it has to be a toe hat. ring. That would be even better. What? A toe ring. Oh, gosh. How no. many of us in this party would be able that to wear a toe ring? A toe <laughs> ring will never be a thing in this world. Or any world I create. You got into that? Sounds pretty <laughs> <laughs> I, I just don't like that. No. <laughs> well, there is a smart thing about a tow ring, man. When it's an enchanted no. no. Nobody can no. no. DM says no. I'm outsmarting the system, Put my man. Fucking foot doing. down. No. Did you no say foot? <laughs> no. I'm just outsmarting the system here. That's all it is. He <laughs> said foot. Put my foot down. There will be no foot rings. Stop saying feet. Toe rings. Uh, okay, what kind of hat is it? We went from the head to the toes. <laughs> Having fun, Sith. <laughs> He's got the zoomies. I know. <laughs> this one? Yeah. yeah. Yep, it is. It's called a tri Tyrolean. Tyrolean. A Tyrolean. Okay, I gotta type this in. Oh, oh that's a silly hat. Hey. A glorified fedora. Oh no! I'm looking at the one that looks like um like um uh, um um Robin of Loxley's hat, oh. basically Robin Hood's hat. Oh um, yeah, I see it. Yeah, uh, try Irolean. Yeah, basically that's what I was thinking of. Uh, Just forgot the king. Anyway, uh, basically it golden has a very lovely light uh, light blue feather that changes into each color of the rainbow shifts constantly okay you made a hat yes yeah, it's, it's magical right try it on well give it to silence here she's the hat we uh, wearer <laughs> do, do i stack it on top of the other hat or do i have to take my hat off 
you would have to take your other hat off. No. You ready to you make this can't... sacrifice, Silas? You guys have to promise to look away. You can't see me that way. You can't see me. <laughs> it's, it's seriously, it's serious bedhead. Just <laughs> There's no hair on your just, just, shave. Just go try it on. No hair. Just... Come on, your fur can't be that bad. Uh, can, wait, Silas, can I get a sleight of hand check? Everybody else give me a perception. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. I don't it like the tone of what you said, Pat. Come on. Uh, 21. <laughs> we tie. 22. Oh, 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 Stop looking at my hair. Look at perception. Every, everyone but Unix who is standing behind a wall <laughs> sees the slight small, bald, bald, bald spot. And He's not actually bald. That was a joke. <laughs> I, I'm kidding. It, it's just the nearest case of bedhead. Just <laughs> and you patch it all out. What I want aim or at wall and cast on offensive if you don't mind. Thank you keep cutting out, sorry. I think he said he, cast your most he, defensive what? spell. Oh no, cast your most offensive, you know, oh. uh, attack spell. This on character who? On the wall. On the wall. On the wall, okay. Yeah, this wall <laughs> up here. What spell slots do I have left? No, his voice is so to... soft it keeps to cutting out. Every day I put my fucking notes in different places where my spell slots. My hand back and forth. I would place you have spell slots. I really don't have spell slots anymore. Hello. Okay. Yeah, I have spell slots. It's incendiary time. <laughs> I love bombs. Do I need just roll damage or? Uh, uh give me. Uh, yeah, just roll damage, please. Okay. Because it's not really all that hard to hit the broad side of a barn, so. I'm yeah, just saying, if damage. she's casting a spell that is supposed of to be a uh, world class, god class, whatever, should we back up? You're fine. Way too late for that. Uh, I say as that like, as the big explosion happens. So as she casts the spell, it, that the normal spell goes without a hitch and you see big incendiary ball like starts launching out and then it stops midair. And then pulsates, <laughs> increases in size, <laughs> increases in size again, <laughs> increases in size again. I think we should duck. Probably. <coughs> Do I need to roll dexterity to get out of this way? Uh, so what you see on purpose, what I have. Okay. As your flame turns from a red to a blue. Oh. As it's now this size. It's now what size? Jesus Christ. Oh, no. Over there. Over where? If I didn't move, I'd be toast. Here. I don't see it. You don't see that? No. The huge <laughs> blue ball of fire? No. I want to reload. Okay, I'm reloading. Holy oh, shit. Am I allowed to keep the cool hat, guys? <laughs> nope. Still don't see it. Okay, we're changing it out. I'll just send a screenshot. I'm like, I saw everything it's else. so big. Fun one, people, one, two. All right, Sundar, express yourself. Oh, oh, that is big. <laughs> That's what she said. Oh, Got him. Wow. I could not. It was It was just sitting right there. Yeah. That's what she I, said. I, <laughs> I did not see it. Mm. Well, it, regardless. Um, it's big. It looks like a fruit. I'm glad I'm way the heck over here. Uh, R.I.P. besties. The gamers are no more. <laughs> I oh, believe wow. we won't be able to keep that. As it continues to grow. <laughs> Please take off said hat. Why? It launches. Wait, what? It starts moving forward. And then it stops again. And then you see it say it again. And then a beam of fire just... <laughs> I fly, I fly up to see said damage. Blinded by the sheer amount of fire that... Ow. This is my new favorite god. Oh my god, this is great. I... Let me describe, uh -huh. let me help you emulate. Kami Kami, huh? I'm pulling you guys <laughs> over here. Currently, so now a lot of people know where I'm looking. Um, we was so up in the mountains last time. Yep, you are currently right here. Yep. I'm going to draw... Hey, you guys ready? Yeah. This is entirely what's now gone. New cat, new cat. Hopefully you can rock the green. I will shoot you! <laughs> what? Wow. 
Did, did we just take out a entire mountain and part of the sorcerer's kingdom? Uh-oh. It wasn't me. I didn't see anything. Um, it wasn't uh, me either. This hat isn't mine. I'm borrowing it from a friend. That is the amount of devastation. Wait. You, uh, there are a mountain, entire mountain. What was his temple still standing now? Um, well, you only hit part of the wall, so... I turned to say, God, I'm like, you know how many lives were lost during that fight? None. Wait, nobody got hurt? Yes. That direction, all of those people were undead. They're just all dead now? Like, dead earth? You just passed it annihilate, dear God. Oh and also, gosh. there's now a beacon where we're at now. This little thing, as he uh, sort of moves his hand, the bat reappears in his hand. No! You're hatless now. Put my hat back on? This little hat. I have yet to think what. But this little hat, yeah, that I just created, helps the caster increase the uh, offensive spell by a hundredfold. That seemed a little bit more than a hundred, just say. Oh, it was simply a hundred. If it was a thousand, there would be nothing left of you or your friend. Have I proven myself? Yes, and how scary your creations are. Very well. As he waves his hand, Pat vanishes. He pulls up his other hand, and and you see time turn back to a point where all the hills are repaired. There's like, didn't reverse time on the undead, though. Gives a little grin. Okay. Yes, still very much dead. You repair the land, but you don't repair your temple. That's because my temple is nature. Got it! <laughs> okay, whatever. I am a god of life. My temple is not alive, but those, those hills breathe fast. They all breathe. I'm allowed to tamper with them, but uh, now that I've proven myself, are there any more questions? Let me tell you, Fritz out here going, what is the meaning of life, the universe, and everything? meaning of life is to love your neighbor as yourself. No! My character chuckles as he doesn't get the end joke. <laughs> oh my gosh. False god. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. At least try to, unless he pisses you off, then knock the fucker out. Huh? Wow. God for revenge. Yes. Okay. Um. I guess I have like one last question since I don't know how well this is going to go around. Of course. What is it? Messing with. She pulls out the orb. Messing with this. Uh, remind everyone what the orb is. Nobody knows what the orb is, except for Rosu, because she got the information out of said guy. But the orb holds souls. Why do you hold such a lot of- Found it on said people who said worship you and cracked your temple. He clearly did not know this, and you see his jovial, like, face has a dark countenance to it. He's smiling no longer. There's just, there is absolute hatred for this orb. I'll tell you. Well, I had some ideas because of where we came from. (coughs) Things need (coughs) exchange to create certain things. And I believe this is one of the materials. Like what? Like creating new weapons, creating life in a sense, um, creating things that will help us. Well, I hate to but I know only that thing will not help you create. It will take it. Thing is the orb of anti-life. Yes, I figure as much. Well, at least it's if not it's an orb simp- of annihilation. <laughs> if it simply stays around person for long enough it takes the person's life along with their soul and anyone in or around it i shine golden at about 50 feet or so so i would highly get rid of it okay would you have any idea of how we might utilize what we used to know to create said objects that we used to do great i would you explain it this is what i had down my calculation. We could create talking minions. About helpers. Well, Aww. yes. But also items and... Oh, my dear. It's very simple. 
He goes into his temple, and you you hear him going around in his temple, and you all of a sudden hear, like, banging of pots and pans, and all of a sudden, God! Seriously, if he pulls out a bag of data crystals, I am going to lose my mind. <coughs> if it were one day, all the I would in disguise, enjoying life with my fellow creation, I, uh, my fellow, my fellow people out there, points to, like, whatever, like, you can't really see anything, but you assume he's pointing to a random settlement or something, enjoying a very interesting talk with a, with a, with a fisherman. It's just enjoying life. An archaeologist exploring a ruined village on this. And he produces the book. I know not what it says. Hopefully, but hopefully you have more of it than I do. It's words are usual. Is it the type of words we've been saying you guys are being confused at? I have, yeah. And he produces the book to you. Okay. Uh, do you want this orb? <coughs> okay. As he just has put out your arm and just just lay the orb out. I'll put it over here. And she just drops it here, backs off again. <laughs> As he, he uh, does anyone here know Celestial? Yes. I don't think I know. I, I do. You do? <laughs> wow. Damn. So two of you actually understand what he's saying. He's like, this could no longer be on spray. I curse it to never curse any being ever again. As light shines from his palm, you just see the very much god of destruction, Gris, when he destroyed Zamasu. It just starts fading from existence, and it just evaporates. Somebody alt-delete that. Did he just control alt-delete that shit? Yep. Damn. Um... You are ho now holding a book. Okay, I am first going to read the cover. It is extremely dusty, and you have to blow it off first. Okay. And its uh, and its title, you, uh, you understand why he did not understand it. Words and its title says Yggdrasil Guide to Making In. Somebody kept their beginning guide. Oh, so lucky. You don't happen to have one that says Beginning Guide to Making Um. Items too. Do you? Hold on, let me check. Goes back in. It's like, oh, wait, one more thing. Taps his fingers and then goes away. Okay. I don't know how adept this book is to this world because in the overall... minutes go by, Tether comes crystals. back. Is this it? And you see, you see a, a you see a very familiar sight of a very confused orc scratching his head, holding a book, and he looks happy. It is indeed the book you were looking. For. Uh, yes, but not the orc. Oh no, it it's just the illustration of. Oh, okay. Actually, um, yeah, that's. It, it, that's there were funny. actually ten of there were actually ten different these books inside the ruins. Stick. I decided to buy them all. There's ten of these. Yes. There was one um um a venture into programming AI system Yggdrasil. Um something called Hack and Strategy Guide. Let's see here. And he just names off all these different ones. Okay, does it sound like a programmer or a hacker list? It, it <laughs> sounds more like a person who is desperate, extremely desperate to find easier ways to play the game. It has several titles that says Dummy's Guide to Races, Spells, stuff like that. It doesn't sound like anything evil. It just sounds like... Someone who was very desperate to find an easier way to play the game. Somebody kept it all when they got teleported here. Oh my gosh. All right. I don't know how well these guides are going to help us because this is definitely not where we came from. Uh, is there anything? I'm going to quickly open up the item one because I'm going to see what they did with the replace of the data crystals. You want to create data crystals? No, I... I don't think we can. Um, I want to see what if somebody actually used this, if they actually crisscrossed out data crystals and replaced it with what? Actually, 
Uh, give me an investigation check, please. Oh, this is why I've been dying to know if I'm not having it. You get lost several times in this Ugh. very confusing book, but you do manage to find a singular reference data crystal, and it is indeed marked out. You see an arrow pointing down, follow it eagerly to find that it's replaced with something else entirely. You read that it's replaced by something called a... It sounds strange to, to you very much. It says a white emerald. Wait, what? That's what it reads. A white emerald. I have never even heard of those. <coughs> Ooh, say this out loud? Yeah. Oh, dear. Um, a white emerald is, um, is very well, well known in this world. How do you know, not know about this? Hence, again, why I said not from this place. Forgive me. Um, a white emerald is not a gem. White emerald flower. I slowly turn to Fritz. It has in its center very vibrant, almost shining. The very edges shines like an emerald. It is a petrified flower that is found mainly found where mainly in mountain ranges deep deep north, where the snow always falls. Is where you will find them. Do they get? Big or do they just stay small? Flower. Don't pluck the flowers. You, pl you pluck the petals. The flowers are way too big to be plucked entirely by a single person. I mean, even him? Possibly him, but you might shatter it. Not. They are big, but they're like... Okay. They are very... Which is why they gain the moniker white. In fact, some people have thawed the white emerald out. And ate herbal of it, but sadly, they're rare enough, and you managed to find a white emerald tea. That would probably be expensive. <coughs> okay, so oh, they're rare, there. but they're not unheard of. Oh, heaven, they're not unheard of. In fact, I can guarantee you most people in the entirety of any kingdom would have heard the white emerald. It's just right now, the white emeralds are being hoarded. So people don't usually get them. They're being hoarded by a group of dragons. Oh, figures. Although there might be batches that are not guarded. Just have to be careful. And I guess you can't plant them yourself? They are not caused by me. They are caused by a natural cause of nature. If I forced it, then it would come out entirely different. I'd rather let nature do it. Although... No, I was just saying we can't plant and what. make them happen. That's what I goes, do I they have give... a god of Mother Nature? <laughs> Actually, there is. A... Don't talk to her. He's very, very, very tempted. And as a favor, I will tell you one such location. I believe there's a kennel directly south of the Dwarf King. Oh. About a day's journey north of the Toad Mountain. Uh, you might find your North so, here at Dwarven Place, about a mile away. Yeah, okay, so it's south dwarf. Okay. And it's about a day's journey north of the Toad Men. Okay, gotta look at the I map. Would put, yeah, preferably. Uh, oh, that way. Right. Oh, I'm gonna just shift ping right here. Uh, oh, it's on the way we was going. So basically, it's about right here, I would say. Dwarf Kingdom is more like five days away from the Toad Settlement, or take. Like to the Twin Witches' houses. What? I never even knew that. Okay. Oh, is there anything else? I think my questions have been answered. Anybody else want to ask a god something? I'm fine. I just want to get out of here. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, by the way, Miss, um, what's your name? Points to. Uh, I'm Silent. Well, it's a pleasure, Miss Silence. I felt. Bad for taking away that little hat, so I gave you something else instead. It's oh, in your pack. Oh my gosh, I'll look. You look, and you see, uh, as you open up your pack, something peer back at you. Oh, not another one. And you just pick it out, and you see 
what looks to be <coughs> working this for a while. Been working on this for a while. <laughs> you see circlet, very fine jewelry that has little hooks that can be placed on top of your hat. It yeah. is shining with magic. Can I do an arcana check? Mm. Woohoo! Hmm, I wonder how your patron feels about this. Can I get a uh, double proficiency to that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to do math right now. That's hard. Uh, 22. 22? Yep. Um, with your, with your cue, realize Skave in a this little circlet allows you this little circlet is known as as evil's lament Ooh. you now cast one fourth fifth and sixth level spell completely free of charge and not take away any spell slot oh my god once once for short or long rest holy shit wait what were the these other are individual slots? Uh, fourth, fifth, and sixth. Okay. These so are give... individual slots. You can do three, and then you have eight or short long rest. Wow! Holy moly! It's like an item of spell storing in a way, but that it just gives you it, three spell slots. Just My make sure you cast at a higher level. This is a god level. So oh, please. Now, aren't you happy you wore that hat? I am very happy I wore the hat. Thank you. Oh, and mind you, you will have to attune to it for a number of three days before it completely ends to your so careful. Okay. Are you rushing to put on your hat already? <laughs> you're no, already I'm not excited. You're already attaching. You're like, <laughs> oh. <coughs> Starting to become more flashy. <coughs> I'm decked out. All right. Fine as fuck. So our questions are answered. Yeah, I doubt you know how we came to this earth. I, I do not care. Yeah, I figure as much. Ew. I guess All I could say is I what was it? Declare that you you have to open uh, openly you, declare uh, you, that you the player you, of Valkyrie is not my goddess. Yep. And you forgive me, I am very bad with names, Sir God. Just call me Allah. Allah is my new God? God is... No, God. I am a man. <laughs> I mean, you're God. Doesn't that mean you could change your gender? <laughs> well, actually, I don't know where you come from. <laughs> I it, have a walk. I can't guarantee I will destroy all undead. And what was the other condition? Uh, he wanted you to come as the base. Oh, lovers. yeah, to be good, which I am always good. Unlike my group. <laughs> as you so, said, yeah. I try to be good. As you say this, you feel a light shine upon as you get lifted up, and you see the darkness start slowly gather around your body as it's starting to like come off of you. As you hear the words, You bitch! Language. You don't tell me to do no language! Please, you're a player too, and you just. Backstab me trying to believe in you. You will pay for that. As as you uh are starting to rip open a portal, trying to forcefully try to grab at you, her bloody see her half dead. <coughs> she's angry and she's reaching for you as you see actually fluffy and silence. I need perception checks from you. What or do they see this? thing reaching yep, out yep. They, oh. they see this happening oh nope uh, he does Sam, not you, you, you see jack shit right now it means i can he's <coughs> paying attention to that statue mm -hmm. <coughs> it's a very nice very nice statue yes Sin, for, some, for some odd reason on the statue you see what looks be like a wart on its nose and it's supposed to depict a god but you realize it's just a pebble on the nose <coughs> Silence! Silence! There you go. And then is Hill? Uh, they both see her crawling out, reaching for you, and they both see as well. You don't need to bother with a perception. As you see bluish, I her just here. As you see a hand grab her by the hair and drag her back in, as you see Dalnan land. 
in her life. What the heck? You just see, look at you, you hear him speak, and his voice has changed since you last saw him. Coming for you next. And the portal closes. Well, your teacher's a freaky. <laughs> Okay. Oh. What is going on behind this wall? <laughs> <laughs> Craziness <laughs> is what's happening. Oh my gosh. Silence. That is silence. Not silence, but Rosu. Yes. <clears throat> I get straight up. No unusual, but can I get straight up wisdom check? Just a plain wisdom, no. Saving throw. Okay. No, nope, nope. Wisdom check. Saving throw check. Oh, wisdom saving throw check. No. No. Not wisdom saving throw. Just wisdom. wisdom check. Yes, that's why I said first and you said no. <laughs> oh, no, that was my first one. Okay. Oh, so, what happened? I'm going to wisdom check to see something. But unfortunately, you didn't get a high enough. No. I mean, it was one away from being. That one. Yep. Anyway, <clears throat> as you go from that, you see all of the darkness has been purged from the body, and you feel a part of you has changed a little bit. Uh, does she have glowy wings? First, you so don't know Rozu, that. I know you have wings. They're invisible. Hush. <laughs> Actually, he has seen them. I know he has. Can. Yes. Um, but, uh, so congratulations, Rozu. You've unlocked a secret. What? I was I I honestly had all sorts of different plans for if you didn't accept his contract. That was very and close. And if you chose a different <laughs> god, uh, uh, chose a different god and chose that different power, I had different things planned for different things. So congratulations on no longer being something. Oh, my race change. We're no longer an ASMR. Wait, what? Damn. You have evolved into a cherubim. A secret race. Cherubim, cherubim. Oh, I've been waiting for one of you to discover one of the secrets. Ah, I've been waiting for so long. Let's go! Oh. Wait, so I'm a little kid now with baby face? Oh, no, no, no. This is a different kind of cherubim. Okay. <laughs> because I'm like, oh, dear Lord, I became the guild master. You are the only one who sees this because as your heir mm -hmm. now have six pairs of golden white. Oh, you, you have six queen total. Okay. You so have what looks to be a halo sprouting from your, from your uh, neck, surrounding your head and going to the other side of your neck that shines across your face. Mm. And I guess those chains are gone too. Chains. Okay. Yay. No chains. Wait. So my hair is now. Is there still your, black in my hair? No. Your hair, where it was black, is now a platinum blonde, and your hair is kind of shining like the sparkling of the sun. Very, very start of the day. Some in my skin like and eyes. Sorry, I'm getting details so I could draw this later. Your skin and eyes are very, um, very ill, almost pearl white. Your eyes are an intense royal pearl. <laughs> <laughs> now, you guys can't see the details of the halo or the or the wing. However, you can see her visage changes visibly. Does she become more hot? Okay, um, I, I look more like a snow elf now. Uh, she is visibly a little bit taller. She's grown about uh four four inches. What? Oh my God! So and I am now six six foot seven. Foot seven. Oh, well, I, all I want to do. Is wow. <laughs> uh, her she is definitely more curvy. In a sense of an hourglass figure. Rosie versus Kilowai. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear Lord. Small now? Why are you getting taller? Stop. I did not <laughs> ask for this. I'm going to land and, on the ground. Your, 
your grave domain cleric clothes. Notice that they've gone from the drab like gray colors to a very royal hole in gold white. Okay. Chris goes, hey, Rozu. No. You look good. No hitting. <laughs> huh? No hitting. Never mind. I'm not hitting you. I'm just saying you look, you look nice. I'm just trying to give you a compliment. <laughs> you, you hear, you hear Kiloi. Well, now you're just hot. She just turns walks. Did not need that extra comment, but thank you. The sexification <laughs> beam. Uh, 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 Allah uh, smiles very gently, walks back into his uh, into his abode, and is like, "If you need anything else, I'll be here." Actually, one last thing. Yes. I'm pretty sure I can't cast anything unless I have your holy symbol. Ah, oh, give me. <laughs> Yes. He goes back into the thing. You see him come back out, and you see that he's ready, almost ready for you guys to. As you see him not only carrying his holy symbol, which resembles that, uh, uh which is kind of like a, um, um, it's kind of like an onk, but with where the circle is is a shining sunrise and right. my brain just <laughs> I missed and, all and the end of it where it's like uh, like uh, bottom of the cross thingy it actually uh picks what looks like a a carved into it it looks to be carved like symbol of life you know rebirth stuff like that yeah. you know and he hands it over and you see that he's ready for you guys to almost leave as you see him carrying in his other hand a pot and he has a pink frilled apron saying kiss the cook and he hands it over and he shuffles back into his uh, to his temple. OK, holy symbol in a pot with the apron that says kiss the cook. Yeah, he's wearing it. He he's oh. preparing for dinner. He's preparing for dinner. Oh, OK. I he guess... handed you only, uh, he handed you only the holy symbol. OK, I'm like. Well, I guess we're having lunch. Oh, did you want some? Uh, I mean, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> how many people can eat? Everyone can eat. I hope you like fried rice with some chicken. chicken. Uh, I could really use fried rice or chicken right about now. Um, vegetarian. Would you like the fried rice? Yes. Vegetarian. If you have cabbage, that would be awesome. I Wait, always what? make it with cabbage. Ooh. Is this, Am is I this a vegan? Yeah, am I going to die from eating this? That's why I was asking, because I don't know about you. Oh, no, it's not blessed. I like it normal. Oh, oh I like it normal, too. Would you like a drink to go with it? I have a vintage. Let's just oh, go sign me up. I think I'll pass. I just stick with water or tea. Synth, are you All going right. to get away from that statue and come in for food? <coughs> By the way, if I'm going into someone's home, I turn into my human form. <laughs> As you uh, go into his house, we'll leave off air. Oh, wow. So congratulations, Rosu, the first one to unlock the secret race option. Oh, my gosh. Woo! I didn't think I was going to get out of this emo stage. Well, OK, OK. So <laughs> the fun part is if you chose the other gods, this, if you chose the nature god, you would have gotten a world class artifact. Uh, that's metagaming. So don't yeah, try it. Yeah. Uh, if you went with the god of death, he would have instantly killed any one of your choosing as long as it was within his power. Oh, my gosh. She but chose the nature. Uh, 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 what? If she did choose that one, which she would have probably, but she didn't really know the dude. You would have probably asked for Valif to die. Well, we pro she probably won't be able to because he's basically a world like. No spoilers. Guy. He would have died. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> 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 no Fuck her. <laughs> There's no retake <laughs> back, state it. Oh, Daisy well, Baxi's no metagaming. Uh, but yeah, that was <laughs> going to be her like second choice because she's like, well, technically I am like a deaf cleric. But thing is, thing is, Bailiff in this, he's not a god. He's a program. He's just an insanely powerful program. Yeah. He's Nothing no god. Yeah. It's within the god's power to kill him. Dang. 
<laughs> <laughs> I'm such a dick. Oh, God. Yes. And I love it.